Guys, talent, I mean, <laughs> got the names wrong again. Sorry, guys. I meant to say cheese effects here. And today, recently, Reaper and McCree got a huge buff. McCree, McCree's Python, I call it the Python, is way more stronger. And you can you can get a lot of people just by getting them in the headshots, like Tracer, Lucio, and, and possibly Yenji. And Reaper is, like, unstoppable. Like, he, like, counter tanks. He can counter Reinhardt. He can counter Roadhog. I don't know about Roadhog, but... But the rest of them, he can counter. Because at close range, his pellets to tanks, they do three. They do three shots. Only, except for Winston, it does two. And Zarya, I forgot. But once when you're D.Va, it's only one. Which is kind of... Right, because... Of course, she's diva. You know, like Tracer, she she has like a bit of a meat on like, and there's like a stick and there's like meat on it. You know, like a hot, you know, like a corn dog. There's like a stick and there's the meat. Diva, she just has a stick. But she has, she just has a stick. She does not have any of the meat. She may got she may got the water. She may got watermelons, but still, she may not got any meat. And, and I could probably understand that that Reaper and McCree could probably one shot her in the face. But ser seriously, McCree is like a monster, and I'm gonna be explaining McCree a bit today. First, about McCree. McCree's pistol has gone a huge damage rate, but not like two times, but a bit less, like a quarter more. If you get the shots right on, like headshot, there's a good possibility that you could probably get a one shot with any kind of fear. Well, except for tanks, because tanks are obviously going to need two, three, or four. But there is no good McCree. Like every, like you have to be like an extremely good McCree, which I am. <laughs> like it's not just like boom, boom, boom. You can get like, like one shot, one kill, like across the map. Like that's not happening. You have to be at least like 10 meters. Well, whatever it says on the training thing on Overwatch, I don't know what that means. M meters, I think it's meters, probably. And Reaper's flat, um, not not Reaper's, McCree's flashbang, it lasts for a bit longer, which might give you a better time at killing someone. Just by pressing L2, just by pressing the L trigger button. Trigger. That's basically it. But, but they did nerf that, so there's a better chance of you getting out of that considering like May or, or Sombra. Cause May, she she can heal herself in time when McCree just blasts her for like that one, sh that one last shot. Or if he just melees you, you're basically gonna be dead. And nothing's changed. Nothing's changed on like the role. Like the role is like the same exact thing. But some people have find, found out on, on Hanamura that, that McCree can actually fly over to that um, one gap. Or you can just like regularly like jump. Or you can just roll. Do a barrel roll, Star Fox! Do a barrel roll! Well, here's another difference. McCree has, McCree has better accuracy now because the fans were complaining that at McCree's accuracy really wasn't like that good and like the range was kind of bad and usually a python is supposed to have like like a bit more range than it usually has right now especially for pc characters like it's really hard to like aim for like mccree because because you have to like control it you have to control your camera by just by using the mouse and that's going to be like a deep pain I feel i feel bad for the people that have to use a mouse in my opinion i i think that mccree's ult is the worst in, out of out of the entire game because one if you're like a Hanzo you can shoot him with a scatter with the scatter arrows and, and if you're Widowmaker you can shoot we can you can shoot him with one shot one kill in the headshot and especially as McCree you could probably flashbang him or probably hook him and probably do that like shenanigans that Roadhog or, or maybe McCree has huh? before in Overwatch McCree legit eat each bullet usually did at least 100 damage. In the beta, it used to do pretty decent damage, and McCree was like the, 
to go to character until when he got nerfed five million times and then finally got buffed before when the game was only when the game was like released like a year ago seriously McCree was already good how he on how he was before I, I just don't understand why they're buffing him now instead of just buffing him like when they when he just like in the beta they should have buffed him because he was like too overpowered one shot would probably kill him he was like reaper before with, but it's not a shotgun and he, and he doesn't have to wield so mccree is kind of like a spam it's like a scam or maybe like a spam type of character because you're always going to be you're always going to be using that right trigger and then that L2 trigger to blast some enemies up. It used to get annoying and that's when they actually nerfed him and then buffed him back up to his normal status in, in, like, like, a, in like early 2017. If you like attacking then you'll definitely most likely be using your flashbang and then, then just doing that like one scam dash spam that you always might be doing. And if you do like the fence you would be back there in the area just shooting your pistol off and hopefully you'll get like a good sh decent amount of shot and if you're like Widowmaker or Hanzo you'll just be up there maybe up in that one spot there just blasting people's heads off and then finally you can get your ult right there now last thing I'll, if I'm going to say if you're going to keep on pulling pulling that the R1 button you're basically going to be just like a scam if you're going to be up up there where like Hanzo and Widowmaker are like up on like the second floor or third floor then you're basically going to be like like a no scoping champion like defending with McCree you would probably just be like blasting off your bullets and hopefully you'll probably kill someone I got you on my side